Hello, Rob from Fountain Pen Journey with part three of what has turned out to be a three-part series featuring the Ranga Abhimanyu fountain pen in different acrylics. Now, you've seen my other two videos before uh, of the other Ranga Abhimanyu pens that I've purchased from Ranga Pens. Um, if you haven't, I'm going to make sure that there are links to both of those videos in the description down below of this video. So it's expand the video description down there and there'll be links there. Um, the reason for this purchase is quite straightforward. There are some pen designs that I really, really love and it's not often that I find a pen that I really absolutely like the design of and I'm really, really just quite comfortable writing with something for a very long time. Um, and the Ranga Abbey Manu is one of those models. It's really comfortable to hold. It's a good sized pen. It's beautiful. The acrylics are really, really nice. Um, I mean, there's things like the Pen BBS 308. I love the design of it. It's simple. It's one of my favorite pens. These Ranga pens are even better. Um, they're just great and really, really happy. Um, I'm going to first, just briefly before I open the package, just state that this is part of the fountain pen group buy from Ranga Pens. So these are not the full priced Ranga fountain pens. If you subscribe to their, well, not subscribe, if you follow them on Instagram, uh, I'll leave the link down below in the description of this video. If you follow them on Instagram, you will be notified when they do a group buy. And they're usually once a month uh, for the full duration of the month, and you can place an order of the selected models in the acrylics that they have. Go directly to their website, and you may find those pens available, but you're going to pay probably about twice the price for them. So you're getting 50% off thereabouts if you go down the group buy route. And this, this is how I purchase my Ranga pens, and I love them. So that's how I buy these, and it's quite a straightforward process. You either go to the bio of the Ranga Pens on Instagram, and they have the link to the Google form, which you fill in and complete all the specifications for the actual particular um, model of the pen that you want, such as the nib, the colour, nib options, things like that. Or you can email Ranga Pens directly. Uh, it is a very straightforward process. It says group buy, but you don't have to be, you know, signed up to a whole bunch of people in your country, that type of thing. It is an individual purchase, so it's quite straightforward, nice and easy. The other thing is how fast these pens arrive, and I have been absolutely stunned at how quickly these pens are not only manufactured but shipped placed an order for these six pens in this package you will notice it's a larger wrapping than normal with my Ranga pens purchases purchased those on the I believe it was the 16th of February 2021 two days later had an email saying they'd been dispatched it took guess how many days to arrive from India in the UK by DHL two days if I placed an order for a pen in the a fountain pen in the UK I might have it two days later maybe three even really good retailers like pure pens cult pens you know they tend to dispatch things once a day at four o'clock and you may get it two days after that this pen these pens came from India since dispatch in two days and that was even delivered in the UK in two days. So really, really incredibly fast shipping. So let's not delay any further and let's have a look at these, more, the uh, Ranga Abbey Manu uh, in these acrylics which I've purchased. So let's cut open the traditional packaging. Always beautiful. Oh, that was a good job. That didn't land on my leg. So I'll tear this off, get rid of the outer packaging, the linen packaging, and we've got a copy of the, um, I guess, the uh, Indian Times or something. Rottweilers unsuitable as pets. 
gravely understood, um, misunderstood breed. Yeah, anyway, I'm not going to read the paper. But that's what's going on in India at the time. And here we have it. There's a crossword there. Um, two Ranga pens boxes. Nice sort of crocodile leatherette box and a, I don't know, alligator skin leatherette box. I don't think I've had these um, faux leather boxes from Ranga pens before. I've had the, um, the sort of velvet ones and things. They're really nice boxes. Nice to, uh, nice to see their own packaging as well. I mean, it, it just adds to the quality of the experience. So let's have a look. I'm going to get my list of colours which I ordered together so we can actually refer to these in the right order now get these oh, get the bubble wrap out of the way because that's just a pain open the uh, open the pens up I should have brought a pair of scissors that would have been a lot easier But no, I like to do things difficult. So let's try and open this this way. There we go, that's working a bit better. So what have I ordered? What colours came in this package? Right, first one of the lot. Now, just refer to my list of products. Right, here we go. Blue Pearl. So it is, I'd say, quite um, quite a teal blue. It's uh, it's coming out quite a blue under the uh, light here. But that is, I'd, I'd say, a really nice aquamarine type teal blue with black swirls. Very chatoyant material. Beautiful pen. <coughs> Excuse me. Unscrew cap, and these unscrew really easily. Nice section, nice length. I will be reviewing these pens in due course, or one of these pens, and show you all the models together. So please do hit subscribe, turn on all notifications, and uh, you'll be notified of when that video is published. Really, <coughs> really comfortable pens to hold. A really nice size, not too, not too big, but very comfortable. They all come supplied with um, converters. I'll just show you that on one of these. Unscrew this. And these are actually designed to be cartridge, converter. You get an included converter. I think it's a Schmidt. But they are actually also designed to be eyedroppered. Now, I will say something about the nibs. Now, with Ranga pens previously, I've always tended to just opt for the Bok nibs. But to keep the costs down I actually opted for the Ranga nibs the steel nibs you can get them in every every nib width you want really there's no obliques or italics or anything like that but you can get fine medium broad double broad there's even a flex nib available you can opt to pay extra which i haven't done with any of these pens um to upgrade it to a bock nib steel nib or a um, yovo uh, nib so there you go i mean i've got all of these pens apart from one in broad so they're all broad nibbed fountain pens so that is the blue pearl um version i have got here oh there is also a free Muffed pen. I think this is yeah. It's an Oliver Exam pen. These are free. You often get these with um, purchases from Ranga Pens, and I love that. So thank you very much for uh, that, Mr. Kandan, the proprietor of Ranga Pens. And these these are Oliver Exam pens are piston fillers, and they're actually really really good. <laughs> they do come in a range of colours. I have reviewed this fountain pen on my channel. So this is the Oliver Exam. Try and get this to focus. I'll move that out of the way. Oliver Exam. These are great, quite slim piston-filled fountain pens. 
and I think they're an absolute pleasure to use. I really, really like those, so that's good. One of those. Let's open the next colour and see what we have. Now, I did go for some more utilitarian colours. This is the solid yellow. And it really is. It's a very nice, bright, cheerful yellow acrylic fountain pen. So I like yellow fountain pens because pretty much every ink there is will go well with them. Doesn't matter, black, blue, red, green, brown, any colour ink you like I think goes well with a yellow fountain pen. So had to get one of the Renga Abbey Manu fountain pens in that colour for everyday use. I shall open up the next colour version so you can see that. I'm trying not to get staples stuck in my finger here. Well, this is quite pretty. This is red swirl and it really is. I mean there is, it, it's, I would say that that has got quite a solid coloured background, nice red background with good chatoyancy. It's not over the top, it's not all over the place, but there is really, really nice chatoyancy in this red swirl version, which of course extends into the, the, uh, the section there. So really, really attractive finish. So we've got three more pens to look at which I shall grab now. So this box, get the, uh, the packaging, the bubble wrap out of the way. And I do like how everything came well packaged from Ranga pens, no issues with anything at all. Now this one is this one is a bit different to one of the other Ranga pens that I showed you in my previous Ranga Abbey Manu pen mail videos because that one was brown swirl. It was an acrylic called brown swirl. And for the February group buy they had another one called Brown Swirl. And I thought, well, you know what, that is actually really, really attractive. I have to have one of these. So this is Brown Swirl. And this version of Brown Swirl, the actual um, acrylic code is R13. So R, Romeo, 1, 3. Brown Swirl. And this version of Brown Swirl has got these black... Um, these black swirls inside of the acrylic as well and there is also some chatoyancy in those black swirls as well so it's really really attractive and this out of all of these pens I ordered with a double broad nib so quite looking forward to trying that with some uh, some different things very very attractive material really really attractive it's quite dark, um, there will be some variation in these acrylics from pen to pen, but that is quite a dark brown with the black in there. Um, I think in really strong sunlight it will really sort of pop because it's got quite a nice warm brown tone. Um, but yeah, really happy with that. And uh, the next one, open this. Now I showed you the yellow solid yellow version and I wanted another utilitarian Ranga Abbey Manu for if you like everyday use um, and this one of course is way more wrapped than all of the other pens so I'll try and get this out safely So this is solid black, 
and I think this illustrates the shape of the pen really really well it's quite an unusual design it's not your typical cigar torpedo shape um, and I think this illustrates how well it sort of fits in your hand black section long section you see that tapering actually really just nestles nicely in the hand really really comfortable to hold quite a long cap as well because you've got quite a long section and a large nib so there's the solid black and the final pen in this package uh, and I took a chance on this because I thought mm, I'm placing an order do I do I buy every single one that I really like the look of and I'm um Denard couldn't really decide and I thought you know what if I don't do it I'm probably gonna end up with a bit of disappointment because I actually thought the color could be really nice and looking at this off camera first time I've seen this I am actually really blown away with it it's absolutely gorgeous it's almost like moonstone so this, this colour version of the acrylic is um, called Pale Green with Green Lines. And I did not expect this to have any chatoyancy in whatsoever. I thought it would be a fairly translucent, almost demonstrated type. I really like the body colour of this acrylic, this green, pale green. Very nice colour with the green lines in. But it, look at that amazing chatoyancy. I mean, the camera is really struggling to do this justice because it is not really able to focus on how chatoyant that is, but that is really, really beautiful. Just unscrew it, have a look at the section. So there we are. I mean, these pens, they do post quite nicely. It becomes a really quite substantial pen there. So hugely comfortable pen to hold. As I said, we'll be reviewing the Ranga Abhimanyu in due course, but wow, that is gorgeous. I mean, <laughs> you can even see reflection on my fingers there. Really, really lovely. Brilliant, brilliant fountain pens. Very, very pleased with this purchase. So let's put all the pens in front of you to have a look at. Is that going to work? No, it's not going to work. Let's pop that on top of there. There we go. So it's like it's like candy, isn't it? Absolutely gorgeous. Really, really, very, very happy with yet another purchase from Ranga Fountain Pens. And I promise this will be the last one of these for a while, unless um, in the coming months Ranga <laughs> Pens have happened to do a. Uh, another group buy of a model which I absolutely adore. So thank you very much for watching and I shall see you next time. Bye.